once upon a time. I miss you more of me. More than any little mermaid. More than a sad More than jewels. I miss a childless baby. More than love. I miss you what? More than anything. More than love. I wish the king is giving a festival. I wish we should go to the festival. More than riches.
God. Because the baker had lost his mother and father in a baking accident, or at least that's what he believed, he was eager to have a family of his own. He was concerned that all efforts until now had failed.
Undertaker might lift the spell. You wish to have the curse reversed? Our leader certain potion first. Go to the woods and bring me back.
my name. When first I appeared, I seemed mysterious, but what explained it? I'm not in suits. Say that again. I read the market. Seems like you could have been there long ago. Taking your time, Jack. No, sir. Is that the truth? Well, you see, I was resting. How much are you asking for the animal? Uh, no less than five pounds, sir. Oh, Jack, why such a sum? Well, my mother said. Your mother? A boy your age? Why? You'd be lucky to change that thing for a, and this is important, a sack of beans. Why, <laughs> um, uh, come now, Milky White, there are spirits here. Don't be difficult, Milky White. <laughs>
fighting for your life. Now go home immediately. I wish to hell. No, the spells in my house. Hello there, young man. Well, hello, sir. What were you doing with the cow in the middle of the forest? Well, I was on my way towards the market, but I seem to have lost my way. And what were you going to do there? And what are you going to do there? Sell my cow, sir. No more, no less than five pounds. Five pounds? Where are we to get five pounds? Uh, your cow must be very generous with milk to fetch five pounds. Yes, ma'am. And what are you to do if you can't fetch that sum? I hadn't thought about that. I guess my mother and I will have no food to eat. This is a sum total. Oh, our beans! We mustn't give up our beans! But if you feel it best... Huh? <laughs> beans will bring you food, son! Beans... in exchange for my cow. <laughs> These are no ordinary beans. These beans are magic. Magic? What kind of magic? Uh, magic that defies description. Well, Mother would... You'd be lucky to change that thing for a sack of beans! 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 How many beans? Six. Five beans. Can't part with all, but we must keep at least one for ourselves, and they're worth a pound each at the very least. Could I buy my cow back someday? Well, possibly.
Oh, I love sweets and I love bread. Where did you get this beautiful cake? Why, so and I, right? My granny made for me. Is that right? I would love a red cake like this. You look pretty foolish. May I take a look at it? I don't like to be without my cake. Please oh, get back. Kathleen. Get back, please. Get back, get back. I said you did that. Don't get the cake. Stay away from the girl. <laughs>
be prepared. Isn't it nice to know a lot? And a little bit not. <laughs> Mr. Baker, you saved our lives. Here. Are you certain? Yes. Maybe Granny will make me a new one for the skin to that wolf. Thank you. <laughs>
<laughs> Sorry, I lost the cat. I shouldn't have yelled. Now please, come back to the village. I will make things right, and we will just go about our lives. No more hunting about the woods for strange objects. No more witches and dim-witted boys and hungry little girls. Go!
more children. I don't have any children. That's okay too. <laughs> well, I haven't seen your son today. Sorry. I hope we can go up that beanstalk again. Quit while you're ahead, I say. Jack! Jack!
takes two. I found one was enough, it's not true. I take two of you came through. When the journey was love, it took you. Unfortunately, 
for a punch. <laughs>
prince, and he shall search the kingdom for the maiden who shall fit this shoe. That's mine. I don't care if it costs me my life. Get hey, hey, it. Hey, no. Hey, I am her the slipper, and all will come to a happy end.
Please, not now. Yes, Luke, meet your father. <laughs>
then you leave me no choice.
Are you all right? I, I think so. And the baby? He's all right. Are you all right? You. Have you done this to our house? Always thinking about yourself. Look at my garden. What about your garden? Look. Destroyed. What happened? I was thrown to the ground. I saw nothing. What could have done such a thing? Earthquake? No earthquake. My garden has been trampled. Those are footprints. What could have done such a thing? Anything with footprints that large is no cool. Do you think it was a bear? A bear? Bears are sweet. Besides, do you see a bear with 40 foot feet? A dragon? No scorch marks. Usually they're like manticore? Imaginary. Dragon? A giant? The royal family, of course. The royal family. I wouldn't count on the royal family to snuff out a rat. With the giant, we'll all have to go to battle. A giant is different. A giant has a brain. Hard to outwit the giant. A giant is just like us. Only bigger. Much, much bigger. <laughs> so big, we're like an expendable bug beneath its foot. I know Mother Manny promised, but 
but now I'm going to find that train anyway. Something asleep. If it were not for the thing, it 
you've been sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and so, after hours of searching for Brandy, our intrepid travelers lost not only their way, but their patience as well. Sir, this is the right direction. Wait down the dell. Perhaps you forgot the way. The path is straight. The path was straight, but now there is no path. The path is straight for you. Wait, that was familiar. They're in the distance, three large oak trees. Yes, I recognize. They're with me. It's the steward of the royal family. What are you doing here in the woods? A giant stepped on the castle. Oh, no. I warned you. Why don't you do something? I don't make policy. I just carry a towel. <laughs> Maybe we should go back to the village. I wouldn't be in such a rush if I were you. Guess which path the giant took to the castle. Oh no. What? All that's left of my garden is a sack of beans! And there's not much left of your house either. But I heard that giants never strike the same house twice. You heard it! Wrong! <laughs>
to push him into our arms. You wanted to get rid of him too. We would have found another way. If it was up to you, a decision would never be made. Now that he's gone, we'll never know what will happen. We'll manage. Must I search him on you for the last? No! Now I must punish him for his wrong. We've suffered too. Do you think it was a picnic disposing of your husband's remains? You're getting me angry. What about our anger? What about our sorrow? Who's this laughing through our kingdom? Be quiet. I'll hide my son and you'll never find him. Don't upset the giant. You'll never, ever find him. I'm blind. You don't. 
don't mean that. You were thinking the same thing. It's terrible. We just saw three people die. Since when are you so squeamish? How many wolves have you carved up? A wolf's not the same. Ask a wolf's mother. Stop it. I suggest we find the lad and give her what she wants. But if we give her the boy, she'll kill him too. And if we don't, she'll kill half the kingdom. One step at a time. Maybe if Jack apologizes, makes amends. Oh. He returned his stolen goods. Yes, he really is a sweet boy at heart. <laughs> She'll see that. You paid Elijah blind! It's because of that boy that there's a giant in our land. Now, while you continue talking about the problem, I'll find the lad and I'll feed him to the giant for lunch! <laughs>
No doubt he's off seducing some young maiden. <laughs> what? I understand that's what princes do. Not all princes. You look just like a princess, but dirty. You are the princess. Get up, get up. I am not the princess here. What do you need to do? I must be on my way back to the castle. You haven't heard? We came upon the royal family. The castle has been set upon by the giant. And the prince? He was not with them. He was killing me. You'll be safe in our company.
just, he told me to always make them proud.
Who won? Oh, we don't know. Yes, we do. We, we can't go on hiding him any longer. Jack must pay the price for his wrongs. Wait, show me where he is. He's over there in between those two towers. You see that tower where the birds are clustered? Jack is in that tower hiding. Thank you. Now just to be certain, I shall leave your kingdom. <laughs>
would like to give a couple specific thank yous to our wonderful band. Thank you. 